question where the effectiveness of any policy is measured by the seamless implementation process across board. Workers across the country are eagerly waiting for the implementation of the new 70,000 naira minimum wage. To this effect, state governments have begun moves to implement the new minimum wage. At least 17 states, namely Ogun, Ekiti, Sokoto, Kebi, Oshun, Enugu, Borno, Zamfara, Kogi, Kwara, Gombe, Kano, Taraba, Delta, others are Rivers, Jigawa, and Abia State, have set up communities to ensure smooth implementation of the new minimum wage for workers in their states. But states like Edo, Lagos, and Adama have commenced in payment of the new wage as a number of pledges to begin implementation in October. So, we kill 17 state governors raising the minimum wage panel, even as the federal government, they said, have commenced uh, payment uh, since I think maybe last <coughs> Thursday. But with this one, what are your expectations uh, in terms of negotiations, in terms of agreements on consequential adjustments on salaries, you know, with this 17 state governors? Yes, um, for some of those states, the negotiations will be grueling. Grilling. Yes, mm. for some of those states. Um, for some states, it won't be a big problem. What the governor of Adama has really impressed me, you know, that little man has really impressed me because what he did, he even started paying before the federal government. Hmm. That's a record. Three weeks after President Tinubu signed, signed mm. the minimum wage bill uh, into law in July. He paid in August. Wow. And what did he do? He used the consequential adjustment template of, of 2019. 2019. Okay. Yes. Okay. You know, once you can, once our people can see that you are sincere, mm. honestly, they will run with you. Okay. They will run with you. They can go to the lion's den for you. Once you show to them that you are committed, you are sincere, and that you are actually working for them. Mm. Not people who are in government simply working for themselves and members of their families and their wayward friends. No. <laughs> he used that template, the 2019 template, mm. and he started paying. Local government workers, he will start paying them in September. Wow. So, and that's the time that the federal government too said it will begin to pay its 1.2 million workers. Mm, yes. The fact that these 17 uh, states it's, have set up uh, committees, okay. you know, to hammer out a deal mm. with, the, with the workers yes. in their states mm. is a signal to me that they are prepared to pay. Okay, it's a sign. Yes, it's a sign. Now, Abia inherited a decrepit state. The governor of Abia. Yeah, the little man who is the governor of Abia inherited a decrepit state. Decrepit in every sense of the word. The roads, sanitation, refuse uh, uh, management, mm. waste management, you know, then the finances of the state, yeah, the everything problem. was mm. in shambles. Mm. It was in Abia that doctors in a tertiary medical institution mm. were not paid for about five months. You owe doctors. Those whose duty it is to keep people alive, you are owing them five months. Do you know what that means? A man whose duty is to keep people's uh, health conditions stable. I don't care. You are owing him. Mm. A man who has injection in his hands. Ah, I don't. I don't understand. <laughs> How do you come to all doctors? If a man has not been able to feed well, has not been able to 
uh, take care of his family. Mm. And you send him out to go and save lives. Save lives. Mm. Those are the people you cannot even afford to owe sure. them one, one, one day. One day. But this is Nigeria. We can, if we have our way, we, we won't owe soldiers. <laughs> and still carry, give them guns. When you owe security operatives salaries and you, you, you still proceed to give them guns. To protect your life. They are going to use those guns Against to, to fend for exactly. themselves. But that is a, a exactly. matter for another day. Now, the when you look at what the man in Adama has done, mm. you also look at someone like Governor Soludo. He said, okay, in my own case, I start paying from October. Okay. So we are getting there gradually. Those governors... They are showing the willingness. Yes, mm. you know, but you see, at the end of the day, we still have to talk about what some of the workers are saying. Okay, yeah, that's another big... One worker said a minimum wage that cannot buy a bag of rice is a shameful minimum wage. True, very true. The reason we are in this mess is the bad management of our currency. We still no matter what currency. we do, yes, everything revolves around it. When we are talking about oh, how much is Dango Tay selling, is uh, um, uh, petrol. petrol. He, he has refused to tell us, but yeah. whether he likes it or not, we'll eventually we will eventually know. Exactly, we will know. We will know. Mm. We will know. Landing cost, Forex inevitably impacts on it. We are moving our currency to 1,000 uh, in the parallel market. 1,700 naira to a dollar. That is, it is borderline madness. Let's tell ourselves the truth. That is true. It's borderline madness People for my currency to be to exchange for about 1,700 naira to the dollar. <laughs> Nobody can explain this away yeah, for me. Is. I can't because I can't fathom why we can or we should get to that, to level. that level. And what we are now doing is okay. If you want to do um, um, a deal in the proactive sense, mm. we will now, because of the volatility that we have not been able to address, mm. we will now say, okay, uh, we'll peg the exchange rate for that transaction. We'll peg it at maybe 1,700. Okay. So that no matter the volatility, mm. we'll be sure that we will not lose money. So... My rice, we have many rice mills in our country, sure. but we are still struggling to provide enough for our people. When Nigerians were jubilating that, oh, uh, they have overtaken uh, Egypt as a rice producer, I looked and I said, you are Egypt advised its people to grow wheat instead of rice because of their water issues. They even incentivized growing of wheat. Mm. They were the ones who deliberately okay. left it for us. So we now came to, uh, because Egypt uh, discouraged people from growing rice, we now overtook them. We are now jubilating. Are now jubilating. We had situations when some governors, yeah, the pyramids, pyramids, yeah. Rice, yeah. rice pyramids, rice that they sourced from as far as Burkina Faso. Come on. When yeah. people talk about uh, judgment, because I see some people, even some people in government, when they want to deceive you, they start dropping the name of God. The, the <laughs> truth is, when judgment will come, all of those people posturing like people who have social conscience, posturing like people who love the Nigerian mm -hmm. people, the, the judgment will start from them. From them. All right, BK, as, long as, I, as much as I love that conversation, but we need to go on this quick break. We need to pay some bills. And when we return, the conversation continues. Yes, it's still John Lee Sangelt. I still have Emeka Madunagu and uh, the veteran, Bika. All right, Emeka, what are your thoughts on this? 17 state governors coming up with a panel. Is this a sign that they will pay the 70000 hour minimum wage? The governors have been dishonest. I'm being honest with you. They were it's part honest. of, yes, they were part of the tripartite committee. Then the negotiations had been on. 
they have been attending the meetings or sending representatives. Mm. So it was, it's not a new thing to them. I heard one of the governors saying uh, that they are waiting chat. What do you mean by waiting chat? What? You see, these things are not rocket science. We're talking about the welfare of people, the livelihoods of people. Schools have resumed now. How will parents pay school fees? How will they pay rent? So the fact that it took this long for them to come up with the plan was very, very bad. bad. Now the state labor, you state, then the state. Is it government? No, the there was a tripartite committee. Mm -hmm. You know, all of this, you know, back and forth, back yes. and forth. And then eventually there was a tripartite committee, even involving the private sector. Yes. Now, the federal government had its own idea. And, I mean, it was even said at the time that government was ready, the federal government was even ready to pay. But it was being made by the state governors mm -hmm. and the private sector. So the, the federal government had to, you know, slow down. He had to tread carefully. You know, otherwise, he could have easily just announced it. Now, with all those negotiations and discussions and everything, why is it that you are now... Federal workers are even crying already that the federal government is saying it would just backdate, it would just pay two months. Yeah, instead of May, they, 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 was, it not in, it was it not in April or May that the president signed it? That, you know, they are feeling bad about it, but, you know, Nigeria, at least, at all, at all, at nine bad pass, sure. you know. <laughs> so, now, you are now delaying it. Okay, by the time your committee is fi mm -hmm. finished sitting, so what it means is that clearly some states may want to push the implementation to January next year. Because we're entering October. So okay. when are they going to now start? You see, these are the things that should not be. Even if you are having issues, you have Obaseki of Edo states who actually came out earlier and said 70,000. 70, you have the other man mm. who used a template. Mm. They, they, they peer review. You can exchange notes with them. Sure. Don't do peer review. Even if, don't even if, you at all. Even if you don't want, even if you are not paying the minimum rights in cash, mm. you can provide incentives. The president, actually, I meant, has not released the palliatives. Where did the palliatives get to? But the state governors actually can provide some of these things, cushion to cushion, okay. because the suffering is really low. Okay. Out there. So, let me just beg the governors. You see, they should as quickly as possible. So accelerate. Accelerate it mm. and pay people with arrears. Please, okay. I'm just begging them. All right, then. Please. I, I, I believe they. I believe they're listening. They should. They yeah. should. They should not just listen. They should implement. They do the need for. Yes. All right, let's move straight to our next.